Hi, this is Alice Levitt from Seven Days Newspaper. I'm here with durians, and they're going to show me how to eat a durian. Some people say the king of fruit smells sort of like a putrefying corpse before you eat it. But I've also heard that it's creamy and delicious, so let's go inside and see what we think. I think I'm having that for dinner. Pork belly and preserved lemons. <laughs> um, I had always thought if I had a child, I would name them Durian. <laughs> and uh, since that's not happening, I figured I'd name my band Durians. We call it Breakbeat Electronica for lack of a better term. It's got a lot of subgenres like dubstep and um, drum and bass. A lot of drum and bass, but um, mostly it's just um, music we like with electronic tools, electronic instruments. We were playing, we were playing machine. instrument machines. <laughs> Uh, the first time I ever had a durian was with some uh, crazy raw foodist friends of mine. <laughs> I've heard that a durian party is supposed to be sexy among raw foodists. That was a pretty sexy durian party. <laughs> Our drummer, uh, Simon, has described them as water chestnuts that's gone paramilitary. <laughs> <laughs> they enter your consciousness in a strange way. like honeydew, but with a little bit of meat in it. The first time I ate one, it, we felt like we could sort of manifest what we wanted it to taste like. So it's like a Willy Wonka fruit? It's kind of like a Willy Wonka <laughs> fruit. I want it to be a hot fudge sundae. Okay, good luck. I think you made me taste a hot fudge sundae. <laughs> I, I thought I was going to eat it and just have these nightmare tastes in my mouth forever, I'm sorry. like you said. <laughs> it's more like a dream. Well, just wait for tonight. Yeah. In, in the middle of the night, it won't taste as good. <laughs> no, you'll just have the durian nightmares. Ooh, we're here with durians! <laughs> That would be scary if someone came at you with that. Make like knee guards with them too. Oh, yeah. oh you you could make yourself into a dinosaur. <laughs> yeah. You should go to tea rugs and give them out. Dude, I'm getting out my durian. I kind of don't want to wash my hands. I just want to go up to people and say, what do my hands smell like now? I think someone would say, okay, it smells like a banana, but I don't know where that banana has been. <laughs> I 
like touring. <laughs> but a lot of Americans, they don't like it. They say, this smells so weird. And I don't think so at all. Maybe you eat a lot of Asian food. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I'm getting my dirty in hell. <laughs> <laughs>